Your Titan is your best friend and partner in battle. It'll go wherever you go and fight for you until it's dying breath. On top of that, your Titan is special. There aren't an infinite number of configurations for every model, but there are options that allow you to tailor your big metal sidekick to best suit your needs and desires. Titanfall 2 currently features six Titan kits that can be used across all of the Titans. Today, we're going to talk about all of them and what their benefits are. Now let's get started. Assault Chip is the most basic Titan kit you can choose from. Installing this in your Titan will give it the ability to use its ordnance and tactical abilities when you're not at the controls. But make no mistake, there's no substitute for having a human at the helm. Assault Chip will make your Titan more lethal when you're roaming around, which means it might have better luck taking out enemy pilots and grunts. Additionally, it'll defend itself with its suite of abilities, but don't expect your Titan to start doing quantum physics with this chip installed. It's still a lumbering hunk of metal, and you're still the brains of the operation. With that said, if you like to fight alongside your Titan instead of inside of it, this kit is definitely a worthwhile option. Another straightforward Titan kit, Stealth Auto Eject removes the margin for error from your ejection sequence. The instant your Titan enters the doom state, he or she will send you flying towards the sky with a temporary cloak that will last roughly until you hit the ground. Just like the pilot tactical ability, this cloak is extremely effective against Titans, but your jump jet trails will still be visible unless you have the low profile pilot kit installed. It's a great way to reduce your chances of getting goosed, but the real value in this kit comes from its ability to remove variables. With up to 8 enemy pilots roaming around maps, reapers, enemy titans, grunts, specters, and other spooky creatures, there's a lot of stuff gunning for your head at every moment. With so much going on, you can't look me in the eyes and say honestly that you're always prepared for everything. I welcome you to try, but I'll see through your deception. But your enemies won't see through your stealth auto-eject. Most of the time. Nuclear ejection adds a new destructive element to your ejection sequence. After you type in a quick password, I'm sure it's just one, two, three, your Titan charges up a devastating explosion. It has a large blast radius and deals an insane amount of damage. Pilots will be incinerated if they're too close. Enemy Titans at low health will find themselves doomed if they're caught in the outer ring of the blast. Meanwhile, Titans that are unlucky and stuck within a few meters of the blast they're going away for a long time. Nuclear ejection is a great way to give a big middle finger to an enemy that thought they could push up on you and get away with it. Or if you like going out in a blaze of glory but don't feel like playing Scorch, nuclear ejection is a good alternative. The biggest drawbacks for this kit is that it's not always easy to get enemies caught in the explosions. One Titan dash and a moment of sprinting is enough to get clear away from what would otherwise be your final resting place, which means good timing is key. Problem is, when your Titan is in the doom state, you're very fragile and don't have much time to wait for the perfect opportunity. Essentially, whenever you're actively trying to destroy an enemy Titan with this kit, you're playing a game of chicken and sometimes you're gonna get fried. Your Titan's electric smoke countermeasures are your main defense against an enemy pilot that's tired of riding mechanical bulls and wants to instead ride a mechanical killing machine. But that's not the only function for your countermeasures. They're great for obstructing enemy view, providing cover for an escape, and you can even use it offensively. But by default, your Titan only comes with one electric smoke, which means you have to be absolutely certain about what you want to use it for. Now, if you had two countermeasures, then you could be a bit more frivolous about how you spend them. Don't underestimate just how potent creative use of your smoke can be. On the battlefield, there's nothing more powerful than the element of surprise, and with multiple smokes at your disposal, you can create that element at will.
Overcore starts your Titan Core charge meter at 30% when you first call in your Titan. Additionally, every time you activate your core ability, instead of resetting to zero, your charge goes back down to 30%. It's a simple effect with a few interesting benefits. Normally when you first call down your Titan, you don't have access to your electric smoke countermeasures. With this kit installed, you do. Next, you'll be able to use your core ability for the first time sooner than normal, and every subsequent core will require 30% less charge to activate. Also, just like Stealth Auto Eject, Overcore can be enhanced by outside sources, this time the Boost Battery Backup. Installing a battery in your Titan grants it a 20% increase to its core charge meter. If you have Overcore installed, call your Titan down, install a battery, and you'll have a whopping 50% of your core charged and ready for action. Finally, Turbo Engine is the most commonly used Titan kit because it provides utility across your Titan's entire lifespan, and it augments your Titan's combat effectiveness in ways the other kits do not. In a heavy chassis, you're giving your lumbering oaf a means to dash to safety when you're caught out of position. In a medium chassis, you're putting your agility on par with a light chassis. Finally, a turbo engine installed in a light chassis will allow you to move faster and farther than any other Titan on the battlefield. That extra agility and speed fits perfectly with the playstyles of the lightweight Titans. There's not too much to say about turbo engine other than it's always a good choice. That's not to say the other choices are bad because they're not and they provide potent benefits that have a serious effect on the moments when you really need it. But like I said before, Turbo Engine affects every moment of your Titan's lifespan. So there you go. Each of the Titan kits has a purpose. So before you head into battle with your Turbo Engine ready to go, think about the possibilities from having two electric smoke countermeasures. Think about the devastation you can cause with Overcore. Think about the days you can ruin with nuclear ejection. The extra safety you can get with Stealth Auto Eject and the subtle benefits of having an auto titan that's a little bit smarter than your average giant metal robot. As always, the name of the game is Titanfall 2, the name of the channel is iBlueAirJGR Gaming for Comedy, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.